beautiful lady needs a rose to brighten her day. I'm more of a box of chocolates kind of girl. Perhaps you'd enjoy the fine chocolates of the Caribbean. Welcome back, Agent Blair. For Operation Little Bear, you aboard a Royal Caribbean cruise ship and locate this man, Ivan Mishnikov. Your mission is to intercept the Ming Mecha chip that Ivan procured last February before he delivers the chip to this woman. Given her green bracelet, we believe this to be the famed Bresna Rousseau. The chip must not fall into her hands. Agent Oliver Crisp will support you from his outpost. Good luck. Oh, I'd rather not talk about it if at all possible. Oh, of course, my lips are completely numb, so it's quite hard to speak anyway. Moving right along, in front of you, you'll find three handy little tools for this mission. Your standard fountain pen tracking dart, a compression blast grappling wire, and of course, your sea pass card. Now, this is your ticket to the ship. It's very useful. Please don't lose it. Good God, he's worse than we thought. Smoking is not allowed in state rooms or in stateroom balconies for that matter, and clothing irons and open flames are clearly disallowed. That's just the ship's emergency signal. Seven short blasts and one long. Don't worry, it's just a drill. In case of an actual emergency, you will hear the signal and then the captain will communicate all safety instructions over the PA system. <sighs> Bear isn't here. He must already be carrying it. Well, that alarm means you need to proceed to your assembly station. Wait, Ivan will have to be there too. They take attendance. That's smart. And if this were a real emergency, you'd need to take warm clothes and any prescription medications. Helpful info, Ollie. Now, where's my assembly station? Uh, right, right. It's only session. I know precisely where that is. Found it. Here on the back of the door. The map also has your primary and secondary escape routes. My CPAS card has my assembly station number two. Told you it would be useful. Wait, are you in a lift? I prefer to call it an elevator. Well, go on foot. Using an elevator is not allowed en route to your assembly station. Mm-hmm. Tell them that. Oh. On your way, keep an eye out for the special backup lighting that illuminates exit pathways. <laughs> it's just spectacular. I'll do that, Ollie. Welcome, Mrs. Blair. Oh, there's a lot of people here. I'll need your help. Oh, sure thing. Green bracelet, eight o'clock. The little girl? Why not? I mean, Rousseau could be a trained child. Two more bracelets, two o'clock. Okay, maybe not. Perhaps green bracelets are trending this week. Actually, they give all the children bracelets that indicate their respective assembly stations so crew can take them there in case of an emergency. I saw it on the ship's safety video during the briefing. Agent Blair, I am so impressed with you right now. I can't believe you actually paid attention to the safety video. Now, this whole kid's bracelet system is really great. It prevents parents from having to look for their children in the case of emergency. No sign. Oh, wait. Turn back to the right. Now that is one nice life preserver. Oh, much better than the one my father-in-law is always blathering on about when we go fishing together. Oh, wow. Look at that. Reflective strips, a built-in whistle. That's a water-activated light. You've got to be kidding me. Eyes on the mark. He's on the move. I've been made. Do not lose him. in the sky working on it coming online now okay straight ahead he's headed for the embarkation deck he must be trying to leave the ship head for the main stairs up or down and what's an embarkation deck down and it's the deck with all the lifeboats minor little detail that i guess we didn't watch all of the safety video now did we now, in an emergency, the crew will lead guests to the embarkation deck from the assembly stations. And, by the way, eating, drinking, smoking, and using your cell phone are strictly prohibited en route to the embarkation deck. 
This man is without doubt the worst cruise ship guest on the high seas. Now you should be coming to a fire door. I'm just working on unlocking it for you. Oh, of, of course, fire doors don't lock. <laughs> that would be a fire hazard, obviously. Wait, I got it. visuals. Blair, what's happening? Packages on the move. You've got to get down there. Excuse me, Captain. I'm Agent Blair. Oh, nice to finally meet you. What can I assist you with? What's the quickest way to get down to the water safely? depicted in this film were for dramatic effect only. No animals, staterooms, or evil villains were harmed in the making of this film.